The National Workers Union, NWU, has endorsed what it says are the bold initiatives currently being undertaken by the government of St. Lucia in the gradual opening up of the tourism sector. The Cabinet of Ministers, on the advice of the Chief Medical Officer, approved amendments to the COVID-19 prevention and control regulations that came into effect the 31st of May 2021 to the 30th of June 2021. The amendments included an adjustment for fully vaccinated individuals, returning nationals and visitors with a negative PCR test and who are fully vaccinated are now not required to quarantine. Deputy President General of the NWU, Solis Myers, says the measure facilitates the reopening of businesses in the tourism sector. We represent a number of um, members in the tourism industry. We have a number of hotel employer partners. Um, so we would have been placed um, strategically, if you will, to actually witness um, all of the implications of COVID-19 from March last year. Um, in terms of the closures, um, the toll on the workers, the psychological impact, the financial impact, um, also on the employers as well. Um, so we were very, very concerned in terms of the future of the industry and, you know, the impact in terms of the workers, where they will be placed, etc. Um, so with the announcement that the government is going in that direction, um, the union endorses these bold initiatives because we see the positive impact in terms of trying to get people back at work, um, trying to make sure everybody is able to recover as much as possible um, as a result of this pandemic because it has not been easy on any sector. The NWU advises that while efforts are being made by the relevant authorities to ensure gainful employment is resumed by the tens of thousands of workers in that sector, all workers need to be mindful that in the current COVID-19 environment, there is a dire need to protect themselves, their families and the general public.